for signing with Beauty and the Stamper. I have a special treat today. So you guys are always saying that I know exactly what I'm doing, but I'm going to show you that I don't because we're going to go into the baking world. And I've got my aunt. She just started her channel. It's called the Bijou Baker. And I'm going to bring her in and she's going to show me how to use this thing. So, all right, I'm going to introduce to you my aunt. Her name is Maria and she's the Bijou Baker. Hi beauties, welcome, 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 and thank you for having me. I guess you should welcome me. First off, let me let Jeannie know this is not a weapon. <laughs> Didn't she just hold it like it was going to blow up? It's not going to blow up. But by the time this is uh, over, she's going to be able to know how to make a border on a cake, and that is a great victory. So we'll take any victories where we can get it, and this one's a, a sweet treat. So Okay, so we're going to move this over, and I'll let you have this side, right? Okay. And then we're gonna point the camera down so you can see it a little bit better. <gasps> true to form, true to form, this is what I do. It's called life, right? This is how my channel runs, I do not edit. <laughs> Why bother? I mean, my life isn't edited, so. Okay, all right, so here's, here's what we're gonna do. Um, there's a pretend cake on here and it's your favorite cake, so it doesn't really matter, but we're gonna put a border on it. <clears throat> This is a pastry bag. This is a 21 inch pastry bag. <laughs> I know, I'm short, she's not. What are you gonna do? <laughs> I'm not gonna complain. Okay, so it's full of, it's full of a whipped cream icing. Um, and when you tune into my channel, I'll show you how to make it. It is so easy, it's almost embarrassing, but I'm not gonna worry about that. And I'll put the link to her channel down below. So, it's full of whipped cream icing that you already know how to make because you just clicked onto my, my channel. And I'm going to show you how to make uh, the shell border. The shell border is the very basic border that you see on all birthday cakes. Um, and it's, it's on all birthday cakes because it is that simple. So you have a bag. You're going to hold it here. And this is just a, a 22 inch tip, uh, a tip number 22, it's not 22 inches. Um, it's a star tip. And it's just got a bunch of little prongs on it that when something comes out of it, it's going to have a nice, well, shell. So you're going to hold it like this when you hold a pastry bag you don't want to worry about all this puff up here you're going to take it and you're going to twist it so when you squeeze all the squeezing is going to come down that's what you want you're going to keep the bag up here clean when it comes time to refilling the bag you're not going to have all this mess to deal with because everything's down here getting on to the shell the shell is nothing but a uh, all cake decorating is nothing but just pressure. Releasing, pushing, and then releasing. Uh, so when it comes to a shell, you're gonna put it, you're not gonna touch the cake because these are these are points. And though the icing will cover it, you just don't want it. You wanna keep a little barrier. So you're gonna start up high and you're gonna squeeze. And as you're draping down, you're gonna start to let go. You never lift. When you see when you see cake orator, uh, uh, decorators bake a cake, you see this motion. Okay, it's not lifting, believe it or not. It's squeezing. When I squeeze, it's going to puff up and then it's going to pull down. I'll show you what I'm talking about, and I'll just do a few here in the middle. So I'm squeezing, and I'm letting go, and I'm draping off. Squeezing, letting go, and pulling away. That's all it is, and it's cumbersome here but don't worry about that squeezing letting go and draping off because if I didn't if I didn't let go as I'm pulling away you're gonna get this and can you see can you see the difference there mm -hmm. okay so now Jean you're up baby <laughs> and and I have yet to meet anybody who, who does a great job right away. You're supposed to mess up. Mess up the first hundred times so that when it goes, you say, I knew that was wrong, and boy, you are on target. So start okay. off with... So um, that's my first thing. I always did it like this, and then I pulled it in like... It never you have a right. lot more control when you do it this way. I'm sorry, Jean. And, and so what you want to do is you don't want to fit anything in your hand larger than like an egg. An, an extra large egg. So, so I'm squeezing this up out of my way so that I can twist this without letting too much come out. Then the only thing in my hand is about the size of an egg. 
That's the only thing in there. And when you squeeze, right now when you're starting to learn, just, just get comfortable. But try to get this in your comfort zone, okay? You're going to be squeezing this way. First, second, third, and fourth. You're squeezing as, as, uh, as, as you squeeze, the pressure is going this way. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you got your... Okay. So I just measure my hand and twist it. Yes. Which you already did, so that's easy enough. Right. Oh, but look, how I know. <laughs> okay. You want it at about a 45 degree angle to your right, if you're right-handed, to your left, if you're left-handed. So you can see what you're doing and where the next shell is going to go. So you squeeze push hard and let go and good. Oh, that's not no. That is good. That is good because your your next one is gonna go right about where that one ended. Squeeze, release, good, Jean. Squeeze, release, and there you go. Give that it a does little not more. look anything like yours. It, well. I've been doing this for a few years, so if it didn't look squeeze good, mm. squeeze, there you go, squeeze and slowly release, there you go, it looks okay, I guess, it looks very good, don't knock yourself, I mean, because this is the first time you've done it, yeah, so I'm, I'm going to say, yeah, you did really doggone good. Uh, I can't, oh, there we go. Can you see what she did? Can you see those? Nice and even, they're even. Even mm -hmm. is a huge key. That's a good job. I'm like very proud of that. And then you just go like this. See? And like this. See how she is? See how what? she is? Look at that. <laughs> Such a dork. <laughs> All right, so. So I think I'm okay. That could go around on a little cupcake. <laughs> it would go around. It would go on a cake. It would go on a cake. You did much better than just okay. And you don't. You know that I'm not going to say something just to coat your feathers. So <laughs> very good. All right. So thank you so much. I'm going to learn more. I'm going to check out her channel. Make sure you guys check out her channel. Give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new. Click that little bell so you're reminded every time I put up a new video. Same with Bijou Baker. Go to her channel, subscribe, the link's below. Alrighty. Alright. Thank you. Happy baking. Bye.